Back to that tense moment here today, two leaders forging a new partnership, but clearly not agreeing on everything. President Castro denying that Cuba holds political prisoners, and as you heard him say, he said, give me a list. These images showing the government here still tightly controlling dissent, protesters arrested just as President Obama was arriving here in Cuba last night. Tomorrow, the president meets with dissidents, the president telling me he chose them, not Castro. And ABC's Jonathan Carl met with some of those dissidents who will be in the room, who will get their moment with President Obama. John, with us in Cuba tonight. And John, you heard Castro say, give me the list, I'll, give me the list, I'll release them. David, the simple fact is Cuba does hold political prisoners. In fact, just yesterday, only a few miles from this spot, 50 people, most of them women, were arrested as they tried to hold a silent protest. The three dissidents who I met with earlier today on the outskirts of Havana know something about this. The three of them have spent a combined 27 years in Cuban jails. And David, they told me today that the human rights situation here in Cuba has actually gotten worse over the past year. John Carl with me here in Cuba. John, thank you.